What's going on, everybody? Here, welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. Today, we've got an update. Actually, it's not today. This is a couple days ago, uh, but we've got some wonderful update news. Some fantastic things that have been added to the game, and uh, it is this gentleman right here. Oh yes, this strapping young lad. This right here is our restocker. We now have a restocker in the game. It's amazing. Now, I did record an episode. However, I was recording during the thunderstorm and every I lost power and everything got lost. So anyways, uh, I do apologize for not having like all this like firsthand stuff. But anyways, let's hop into it. Let's get back to where we're doing. Um, so let's talk about the new person, our new hire. So we have Restalker 1, which uh, starts at level 15 um, purchase rack. You have to have one rack and you have to have one uh, one storage. So for Restalker 2, we have to be level two. We have to have four rack or six racks and then we have to have um, Required storage, one of one, one of one, one of one. It, it just requires like a one of one storage. Now, I think eventually it might require like, you know, section three, four, five, all that stuff. However, it, it right now it doesn't. So yeah, it's pretty amazing. So um, yes, there's our new hire. It was super amazing. And let's go ahead and talk about some of the other new changes because as you notice, you'll notice that there's uh, look at that. There's little emblems now, little, little item icons for each shelf that we've had stuff on. And you'll notice this says zero and this says nine and that says 12 and that says 11. Well, guess what that's for? That is so you can mark what shelves you want to be stocked with what item. If you do not have a shelf marked with an item, it will not get stocked. So you do have to mark the shelf before the stalker will stock it. It's amazing. I know it's fantastic. It's, it's absolutely fantastic. It's super great. Now, this is also great because this also functions on the same side as the storage. So now, Basically, what I have gone and done is I so basically how I have my, my store laid out is I have the items, you know, numerically done uh, first item, second item, third item, fourth, five, six, seven, so on and so forth. So I did the same thing over here where I did um, item number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, so on, so on and so on. So this is my storage that I have right now. And I did I did one shelf for each item. So each shelf, I believe, holds two boxes on one side, two boxes on the other. So I believe it holds four boxes in total, uh, depending on the box. Maybe some bigger boxes it doesn't, but uh, everything I've tried, it does, and it's super amazing. But basically, what happens is we throw stuff in the in the shelf. Yeah, actually, you know, let's just let's just go ahead and get some stuff, shall we? So mark it. Let's go ahead and get one, two, three, four, five, six. You know what we need? I mean, we need some stuff anyways. So let's see. We're at nine and ten. Let's go ahead and get those uh purchase oh you know i just realized that was anything so that is going to be messed up anyways um so if i just go through and i put these where they want to go so if i just place that there i don't have to do anything that's it if i place the bread over here let's see bread's right here boom place the bread there he will go and stock the shelves as necessary as required to keep everything nice and full it's amazing i love it i absolutely love it now, I know some people may be commenting, well, what's the difference between stocking the shelf yourself and just putting it on this shelf? Uh, you don't have to click a thousand times and you basically are just running straight into here and it's the same thing. Oh, uh, I, it's really hard to see, holy moly. Okay, we're gonna put this right here. There we go. <gasps> Fantastic. Let's see, if we turn the lights on, does that turn storage lights on? I wonder, hold on a second. If I go into here, we go into furniture, add a spotlight, we buy that. Does that work in, uh, does that work in this building as well? Oh, it does. Oh, it's not as bright though. Hmm. Okay. So we're going to figure that, <laughs> we're going to figure that whole thing out. Oh, that's all right. Oh my gosh. You know what I just realized? I think I skipped oil. Oh no, I didn't. It's right here. It's right there. Okay. But water, did I place the water there? Ugh. I must have placed the water there myself. That's not good. That is no, no bueno. No bueno indeed. Now, also, another thing that I have noticed is that you have to put the items in a shelf in order for the stalker to take them. The stalker will not take items just sitting on the ground like this. It's like this orange juice that we have here. This this classical OJ will never get stocked unless I actually place it myself in there. So like that's good. But um, if I wanted to get actually stocked, I have to throw it on a shelf. So just setting it on the ground does not cut it. Okay, so our day has passed. Um, our stalker is doing his thing. Well, actually, yeah, he just finished. Um, but you know what? I forgot to pay some bills. So let's go ahead and pay our bills. Oh my gosh. And let's go ahead and start our new day. That way the uh, employees will get paid right away. Okay, so uh, peanut butter and the cereal went down. Oh, shoot. 
Oh, darn it. I messed that up. Okay, I forgot if you click the thing, it changes it. Uh, we're going to go to 650 on that. And then peanut butter went down. Okay, so four. We'll just do 5.00. That works there. Awesome. Awesome. So employees are paid. Bills are paid. What we need to do is we need to go through and we need to start ordering everything. I want to try to order a box for... I want to try to order one of everything for the shelf real quick. So let's see. Let's do that first. Now, I wish we could order more than 10 at a time. I kind of wish there was an upgrade for that. Maybe there will be. Maybe there'll be like bulk upgrade or something like that. Bulk buy upgrade. I would really like to see that because buying 10 at a time sometimes messes me up. Like, um, I don't know. Maybe I should Maybe I should buy them in the like. Maybe I should buy them like one, two, three, four at a time instead. That might help me keep things like tracked. <laughs> All right. So we got these shelves a little stuff. <laughs> A little stocked oh my gosh it's not very well all right we gotta get some we gotta get more food here all right so we ended with uh we ended up with peanut butter i believe so let's go ahead and pick up some of these oh no i'm i'm running low on funds here um let's see we're 43 dollars over uh let's take out this one and that one we have a dollar left to our name right now oh it's not good all right, so we bought what we could. So I guess the only other option, logical option, would be to open the store so we can start selling stuff and making some more money. Oh, we need more money. All right, so I let most of the day go here. Uh, we're coming right to the end of the day. So what we're going to do is we're going to do the same thing we did yesterday. Basically, I want to go ahead and get my shelves as stocked as I can before I do any more upgrades. Because if we have product to sell, then we'll be maximizing our money every day. Also, I know I know the registers are full. Um, so what I'm going to have to do is probably start checking people out myself as well. But we're going to go ahead and wait for these guys to finish. Get the new day going. Restock the shelves again. Um, and basically just try to get our shelves here stocked with our new stocker friend. This this guy's amazing, by the way. Like it's, it's, he just, it's non-stop. He is a hard-working machine. All right. It is a new day. Everybody's been paid. Hold on. Let's make sure we pay our bills. Get those all done, and we are good. Okay, so we are going to stock our shelves. We're going to get our shelves full here. So I'm going to go item by item and uh, just try to make sure that we can max out everything here. All right, so I ordered a little bit of everything. Um, the shelves should be getting stocked here. These ones are looking really good. What the heck? Completely missing the flower here. Did I, like, completely skip over that? Let's go ahead and get four boxes of that. We'll throw that in here, and then... Uh, let's see. That is not the same. It is right here. Okay. Um, and then also, I don't have any shelving for the refrigerated stuff. Now, I don't believe that you have to have the storage be like refrigerated storage. I think there's just storage right now. So it just goes on a regular storage rack. So, um, you don't have to really worry about which one's which. But we need to get the storage racks in here. We also need to get some expansions because then we could also start using the door. The door would be fancy. But our, our shelves are looking, oh my gosh, our shelves are looking mighty fine here. All right, let's go ahead and let's get some, uh, let's get some cold food in here as well. Okay, the stock, the shelves are looking at fairly stocked. Let's go ahead, let's open this bad boy up and we'll let this run through a little bit. I'll probably go ahead and do some more checking. Actually, uh, curious, management hiring. I need another, what, 50, 43 people? That's actually not terrible. We need level 20 still, so. Still good on that, still good on that. Gotta make some money though. All right, so our, our shelves are looking pretty good. Uh, they're, they're still going. It still takes a little bit to get things uh, to, the, to, to get things going here. So I have, I, you know, I bought some stuff, got some stuff back here. It's slowly getting restocked. It's one of those things, it's going to take a little bit of time uh, in order to get everything, like, you know, fully stocked and operational here. Like, it's going to take a few days because the money to, uh, to basically get it going, you know? And then, oh my gosh, like <laughs> the money to expand now too. Oh man, like we're gonna get this whole system figured out. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into, um, we're gonna go in here and we're gonna buy another licenses. Cause like, look at all the licenses we have. Oh my gosh, there's so many licenses for so many things. Um, and then I was also, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you my opinion about this whole system right here. I like this system. I love being able to see like what's what, what's where. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm almost tempted to not even have this system like this like i like knowing what we have in stock back here and i'm sure if the front was like fully stocked it'd be good but honestly when it comes to like ordering stuff and getting stuff out the door i, I kind of just want to grab it and just throw it wherever it'll go you know um but then again if we leave it if we leave it organized like this then we can you know we can stock multiple things on multiple shelves you know we can have uh, multiple items i think our peanut butter was like three boxes deep too so 
I don't know. I need to probably leave it like this, but um, yeah, it's kind of funny. It's just it's just interesting. But yeah, things are going great. Things are going nice. The stalker works good. The new system works good. I'm enjoying it. I like it. And um, yeah, hopefully you guys do too. But that is going to end this episode. Uh, a little bit shorter of an episode. I do apologize, but I want to get this out there because yes, we have a stalker update. It's absolutely amazing. And leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Are you using your stalkers? Are you having fun with them? Are you enjoying? Um, but yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you the next one. Bye, everybody.